So let's go through a couple things. First of all, we know we can um, integrate here by taking out this 5, right? So let's take out the 5 for, let's just get rid of the 5 for a second. Um, now, we can keep the 5 in there if I think, but obviously I kind of forward thinking a little bit here. We, when we go ahead and find our u, that's going to be negative x squared. So when I do du dx, I can solve for du is going to equal negative 2x dx. The reason why I got rid of the 5 is because I, I, I looked at this in my head and I said, OK, if I'm taking u and I'm doing derivative, I'm going to have a 2 and, I'm getting, and there's a 5 here. So that's not going to be any kind of fun there. So what I can do is take out the 5. This is another way to look at it. If you guys remember the other problem, I multiplied by the fraction, which we could do. Or you could take out the 5 um, and actually, here. Let me just actually re-explain that. Because I did do it a different way previously. I think it would benefit.